Hey YouTube, this is Scotty Small with um this Lego candy machine I made. It's not exactly mine, but um yeah, Hayden Studios helped me make this. Hayden Studios did most of the programming and I did most of the building. Or Hayden Studios did all the programming, sorry. But um yeah, the coin goes in here, takes twenty five cents. Um yeah, there's a combination, you put a little key in right here and you have to type in a combination to get the money out. It comes out right there. Yeah, just almost knocked over the touch or the light sensor. So this is composed of um let's see, it's one NXT light sensor, one RCX touch sensor, one NXT touch sensor, one NXT brick, um one NXT motor. No, no no NXT motors. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, also. Oh yeah, there are two RCX motors. And so yeah, this And an thing, NXT color sensor. Yeah, and one NXT color sensor is right here. So when I you see what the color sensor is used for. It's actually just the color lamp part. So when I put in twenty five cents into the coin slot, you see a blue light came on. If you I'm not sure if you saw that, but there was a little smiley face that popped up here and then the gumball oh sorry, I'm looking at the camera, it's off, so the gumball came out right here. So I'm gonna set the gumball down right here so you can see that you can hold more than one. And I'm gonna put another one, twenty five cents in here it's blue. Uh, I couldn't even tell if he was a white guy yeah. or a black guy. So, yeah. Oh. You're knocked it over. I can't see it. But right. these are the two that I just got. And the, the really cool features about it are that there's a combination to get the money out. There is a... Um, it was able to do pennies, but um, something happened, and I decided not to because it wasn't working very well. And then there is a automatic slide out tray once you put in the combination. I have not found yet a way to cheat. And then there's this, this thing that I added while he knows programming, or Hidden Studios is programming it. I just kind of added this because I was bored. Just pull off a small little piece for no reason. Just kind of added it there. So yeah, um, use a full view of it. That's the coin tray that comes out. That's all we really have. The touch sensor really wire. Then the head sensors in here. So yeah, I guess I should show you the combination. So uh if you try and find the key anywhere, it's right here. It's kinda hidden. Then I'm gonna show you what happens when I get the combination wrong. So let's see, I go a couple short clicks and a couple long clicks, like it turns red and it says it's wrong. So if I try a different one, like. It says it's wrong, and then now I'm going to put it in the right. I'm going to put it in the right combination, which is a couple or three short clicks, two long clicks, and three short clicks again. So it's like this. You can see. The tray automatically slides out, then you can get the money out. And then to put it back in, the really cool part is you can put it in at any way you want. Like you can put it in like almost, almost fully there, or fully out, and it will still bring it in. Cause you can see that when I press the button, you might be able to hear the motor running, RCX motor running. I'm not sure if you can, but uh, it runs until the touch sensor back behind it gets clicked. So. This will bump into the RCX touch sensor and then it will stop. So, yeah. So, yeah, um, Hayden Studios helped me out a lot with this with the programming. And Hayden Studios' little sister, uh, she gave us some of the Lego bricks. And Hayden Studios provided the, um, the Technic bricks and stuff like that, and the NXT and RCX motors and touch sensors so yeah um comment rate and subscribe to hayden studios and scotty small and thanks for watching bye